Hey Venom Squad, Willie Venom Central here. Hey, we're coming at you with another video today. We've had a crazy week. It's been just insane here. We've had a lot of work to do, and we know we're a little late with this video this week, but I'm gonna tell you, we got a new piece of equipment in, and it's something that I've been wanting for a long time, and it's pretty instrumental with our Bushmaster studies, and it's gonna help with a lot of the animals. We actually got our ultrasound equipment in, and so I've been studying and reading and learning how to use this damn thing <laughs> and learn how to read ultrasounds. But we got a cool video coming up for you guys. I mean, we've been filming a lot of stuff all weekend long, but we did an ultrasound on our Gila monsters and we've got gravid females. So we, we're going to show it to you guys. We're going to show you the eggs inside the mama. We're going to show you everything. It's really cool. But... We also did a lot of feeding this weekend, and I did a lot of the Venom Cam stuff. And I'm going to tell you something, guys. Watch the video to the end. There is some epic Venom Cam footage in this one. This is probably some of the best Venom Cam footage I've ever got. It is epic. There are some strike scenes in here that are just going to blow your guys' minds. It's really cool, and it's one of my favorite things to do. And we haven't had a Venom Cam video in a while so we spent all weekend feeding and picking out the best scenes for you guys but the ultrasound's coming up check out the eggs inside our mama gila she's due to have these eggs pretty soon but it's a neat piece of equipment and i want to share this stuff with you guys this is what we're about education and i want to share all this stuff with the venom squad so you guys hang in there and stay to the end of the video the best is at the end Hey, and I want to give a big thank you to our generous supporters who constantly support us. You guys never let us down. Uh, Dan McCarty, thank you, brother. Hey, and one special supporter, Diego. Thank you, bro. It's on its way, Big Daddy. Diego's done something really special for the channel, and I'm not going to blow the surprise till after we get it. But it's it's no small... Let me tell you, it's it's huge. It's really huge what Diego's done for our channel. And uh, he actually done it for all of us because it's going to be some new stuff to film. But anyways, thank you, Diego. And we're working on it, brother. It's, it, it's on its way. But thanks to all the Venom Squad for all your support. And we're going to keep on plugging at this. And Venom Central is going to be here for you. So hang in there, guys. We got some cool stuff on the way. Okay, guys, this is just another day at Venom Central here, and we are ultrasounding our Gila monsters today so we can see if we got gravid females. And they look gravid, but you know, we want to know for sure. So we got us an ultrasound, and we're going to see what's going on with this girl. And I got to get this thing in my hand the right way. <laughs> look at her. <laughs> It's okay, Mama. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, yes. Let's see here. Oh, yeah. There's an egg. We got to get her to be still. Can you see that, D? Uh-huh. You see the... There's, I do. See that? Yeah, <laughs> that is cool, do. ain't it? Oh, that is awesome. The thing is, is see, you can see three of them right there. Yep, three touching. Three touching right there. There's four. You can see the complete oval of the eggs touching each other. Let's try it sideways. Let's see if I can reach over and adjust the focus a little bit. Maybe we can get a clearer picture with this thing. It's all about the gel. Okay. She's getting ready to drop these eggs is what she's getting ready to do. Aww. There is one, two, three. Let me go over this way. Four and there is there's a there's another big one right there that's five one two three 
And the secret with this thing is you got to do it slow. Can you can you make that out there? You can, I can. See, yeah, you can see the uh -huh. see all the you can see the four round eggs all bunched in touching each other. Yeah, you can definitely see a demarcation line where they're <laughs> right. different. That's neat, ain't it? Mm -hmm. And then like I can see that fifth egg is up high. Uh-huh. Is up here. Right. Right there. Oh. Okay, little girl. We're not gonna disturb you too much, sweetheart. We gotta get all this gel off you. Okay, so so with our ultrasound we've froze the image of the gila and it was great news she has eggs in her and i'll tell you okay see so you can see right here is a perfect oval that is one egg and you can see this right here now mind you this is just a very small space that that ultrasound gets so you kind of got to be able to read the ultrasound itself and this is a good shot of a full egg right there here is another egg right here and here is the tip of another egg touching these two and here's the tip of yet another egg touching these two so basically our screen got these two eggs and then these two eggs that's pretty slick ain't it and now as i was moving the ultrasound up and down her body there is another egg that is sitting up top of this and then i start seeing some internal organs and things but she's got five eggs in her that's awesome <laughs> that is so cool isn't it but this is the kind of stuff we do here at Venom Central. I mean, I mean, we're not going to do silly things. We do the right thing by our animals. We want to know the stages of development. We want to know everything. And that's what our channel is about. It's about education. And I want to show you guys all this stuff. I want to share all this stuff with you guys. So that is neat. And I am ecstatic. I'm going to have Gila Monsters again this year. And I'm excited about this because... I'm not a Gila guy. I mean, I'm a venomous snake guy and a crocodile guy. But, you know, we bred them last year. And now we bred them again this year. So, I guess maybe a couple more years, you can call me a Gila guy. <laughs> but we only got two, two adults. And I got all the babies from last year. But isn't that neat? I can't wait to do this with the Bushmasters. Oh, that's going to be cool. The ultrasound's cool, ain't it? I mean... To be able to do that and to have the capability to do that, and I've been training myself how to use that machine, it's just, it's, it, it's a game changer for us here at Venom Central. And we're going to do a lot of other animals. Um, we're going to try to get the video footage of the Bushmasters, but I've, I've got to have my partner with me. I've, I, I've actually got to have more hands on deck for them. So we're working on that next. But hey guys, uh, the Venom Cam stuff. It's on its way. It's coming. So don't run off and stay to the end. The Bushmaster Venom Cam scenes are epic. So don't miss it, guys. See if we can get some Venom Cam action here. We're going to see if we can lure this little gravid female out of her box there. Oh, very nice. That might have just turned out really well. That was a nice straight on strike and I wasn't sure if she was going to feed today. I mean, she's pretty close to dropping these babies. I mean, she has got a mess of babies in her right now. I'm going to try to lure this female. This is my gravid female Crowless Basiliscus. It's the Mexican West Coast rattlesnake. What are you doing, girl? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I'm surprised she's still eating too. She's probably just weeks away from giving birth. Well, she's going to take a rat and that's good. I like it when they eat. I like it, especially, I mean, when, when snakes are gravid, they normally won't take food. I mean, they get to a point where they're just so uncomfortable that they don't want to, they don't want to take any food in until they drop the babies. But she eats all the way up till she's ready to drop. So it's, it's pretty good and it's good for her. It keeps her strong. 
because she is going to drop a mess of babies here probably in the next several weeks. Oh, 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 damn girl. Oh, look at the holes in that rat. Unbelievable. That is immediate damage right there. That's a big fang knocking a big hole in it, boy. Wow. And there's that little girl. Now this is a, the Bothrop Flake Horse. This is a big snake. This is a six footer. She's a big healthy girl. And let's see if old Maximus here, our our 20 pound Mexican West Coast rattlesnake's hungry. <laughs> I guess he is hungry, huh? Oh boy, he's like, yeah, I'm ready, Dad. Hook me up. And that is a big boy right there. That is one hell of a rattlesnake. What do you want it to do, touch you, girl? Oh, there we go. <laughs> You're getting spoiled, big girl. Since we're on the Bothrops roll here with the Venom Cam, we're going to go ahead and feed this Bothrops Brazili. And she usually has a pretty nasty strike, so... <laughs> I don't think she even touched it. Did she be? Barely. Barely? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I seen that big old mouth come wide open. Maybe she'll hit it again. Yeah, cause. Oh, there we go. That was the hit. She's like, I bit it. It's gonna die, huh, girl? Okay. Look at her standing up like that. She's she's periscoping like a damn bushmaster. This is a really cool snake, and this is about a toxic son of a bitch, too, boy. Talk about <laughs> hemorrhagic and coagulants and all the mixtures that just send everything in a complete disarray in your body when they bite you. I mean, this snake causes a lot of snake bites in Brazil. Here you go, girl. I'm going to set that right there for you, sweetie. There you go. But this snake literally... I mean, we can't pair it up. We're, we're, we're trying to find a male, and we're having a hard time finding a male. They're, they're, they're pretty rare to get in the U.S., and uh, we've got this female, 
And I don't want an interbreeder with a Leochorus or a Mugenii or, a, or anything else. I want to keep her bloodline pure. I want to produce pure Brazili. So we're on a hunt for a male for her. But uh, this is one venomous snake right here. This one, this one is a hot son of a bitch. Let's see if our little Muda here is hungry. Little, all eight foot of them. Now, nah, baby, you gotta get that light out of there, honey. Okay. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> oh! Well, he popped it. That's for sure. He's hungry. Oh! There's another one. And he hung on. There you go, babe. Hold the light right there. him a little bit. I don't mean to make y'all dizzy, but that a boy. He gonna come out here like a scud missile. Here he comes. Now, let's see if we can get this this guy to thermal bob his way in here. That's it. Come on, buddy. Oh, yes! Oh, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Nothing has stronger heat sense and pits than a Bushmaster. These guys are just a, just a miracle of nature. They can just lock in on something. And, then, and what's really cool is they can do this in just pitch black, total darkness, and be just that accurate. Now, I gotta lift him up and put him back in there. <laughs> oh! Not yet, girl. I'm gonna make her chase this thing. <laughs> These things are just so damn aggressive, it's not even funny. just a baby. That's just a two-year-old. Venom Central. Fierce, fascinating education. If you're new to the channel, hit the V logo and subscribe now. Come see more of this stuff. Hit the bell notification so you don't miss an opportunity to see any of our videos. And come on back and check out Venom Central. This is Willie checking out. Later.